you need to do is first you need to have a copy of Leopard or the reinstalled disk that came with your Mac. Now this can be um, one that you bought at the store or the one that came with your Mac and then just put it in it's your Mac. Now this little window right here will pop up but you can just exit out of that and then oops, go up and restart your Mac. Hit restart. Okay, it's now restarting and right after you hear that noise hold down the option key now this screen will come up and you'll see boot from uh, you can choose to boot from your hard drive or the install disk. Now, use the arrow key and go over to Mac OS X install disk 1. Then hit enter. See the little Apple icon? Now, this part takes, it took, it takes a little while for it to um, boot up from the disk. So I'm going to stop the video and then restart it once it's all booted up. Okay, well it took about two minutes for this to load. And once it has loaded, you use the arrow keys to choose your language. English is the top one. So, and then you just hit enter. Then wait a little while. Now, you'll see up here in the top left hand corner, I'm not sure if you can see it, sorry about the video quality, but then you choose utilities, and then you go the first one, or the second one, excuse me, you hit reset password. Now you choose Mac HD and then you choose the user that you want to reset the password for then you type in the password I'm just going to use Apple and then type it again and then you can make a hint or whatever I'm not gonna and then you hit save And this doesn't reset the password for their um, for the login um, keychain and the keychain application, but this does let you get into their um, profile. Okay, and now the password has been saved, so you can close out, and you'll see this welcome screen again. And then you just go up to the Apple or excuse me yeah. then you hit on you hit Mac OS X installer and then you hit quit Mac OS X installer and then you hit restart and then it will restart your computer and it'll bring you back to the login screen where you can use your new password that you just changed to log in and do whatever you need to do this has been Mac and Computer Help, and thanks for watching. Bye.